probably see it down below in the thumbnail and title. We are doing some eel boat fishing. We're hopefully gonna do a catch and cook and we're also gonna be doing some ice camping tonight. We got myself, we got homie cameraman Brock. We also got my cousin Freddy and I believe Marshall Outdoors might even be joining us later. But uh, I think tonight camping is just gonna be me and Brock for the most part. But yeah, too short for a long intro. So let's just get right into this. Oh God, yeah. sounds like a nightmare if you ask me. I used to be the guy who killed to get a number one. We have arrived to the lake, Barters. And I'm going the wrong way. Nice. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Well, stay tuned. I'm about to meet up with Cousin Brady. It's just over here on the other side of this bay. Yeah. Let's strap on the old chesty. Try to freaking find some bourbons. We're definitely gonna like do some whole hopping, eh? We're I not, think so. We're not just gonna set up today. It's freaking really nice out today, so. We're gonna definitely spend most of the day probably whole hopping outside or maybe even outside of our trucks, but stay tuned. I'm really excited. Hopefully we can catch a bunch today. Digger and four! It's just blazing trails. There's kind of a lot more snow than I thought. Yeah, there's snow. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, yeah. We gotta get our boots on and everything. Yeah. Sick. Hi, friend. <laughs> yeah, baby. We have found bread. Stay tuned, y'all. About to get all the gear on. Catch any? All right, y'all. Got the grip. Just need ourselves a rod. And I think I'm starting with the jig, Brock. You're starting with the jig? Yeah. Okay, I like that. I like the jig head, especially in the daytime. As you can see, y'all, we just got ourselves our standard jig head. We just got some 12 pound fluorocarbon down to 10 pound braid and just using my little Mav snare while I rod. Might be a little underpowered, but it, it'll be pretty fine with just the jig head. Anyway, stay tuned. Basically, just gonna be falling around Cousin Brett and uh, yeah, let's try to get some of these fish pinpointed. Sound like Brett's already gotten three. Hopefully we can catch 300. Oh, oh, oh. You been getting any big ones? Some decent ones, nothing crazy. Like 10 pounds, nine pounds? Dang, nice. It's not a bunch, but they're getting skinnier now, too. Really? Yeah. That's crazy to me that they're already, like, spawned I know. out. I, know. I feel like every year we should have been here a month ago. I know. Well, I've been here for freaking weeks, but they've just been weird this year, dude. Like, weird as in? Not, like, going hard, hard. Like, just swimming by you and stuff? Yeah, a lot of that, and then just, like, not seem, not, it seems like they ain't getting in their spawn balls the whole day. Like last year? I'm pretty sure I instantly had one down there. Oh, I'm sure. Like, I'd say weed line's like up in here and that like where you're at. I just, just got hit. You. Or it one just, right I didn't get line. hit. One just rubbed up against my line. Mm -hmm. That's what happened. So it's like a skinny sand funnel here. Really? Sand, weeds, and then zebra mussels. Huh. And they're following that sand line back and forth, back and forth. Like anytime they're running back and forth, just cruising. They're on the sand line. No shit. I knew I was marking one, dude. That's what it was, too. I felt its tail just brush up against me. He's still down there. Huh? Every single one shows up like right there, comes my way like two feet and then goes back. Should I drill a hole right there? If you want. You might as well be right where they are. Where at? Right there? Yeah. That's the spot. This thing freaking rips. Yeah. It's weird that they stick to one path like that. Yeah. Nothing underneath. Oh, I'll go back on. What are you doing? I'm gonna run over there where all them holes are drilled right over there. Oh, okay. Is there anything in front of me? No, you should be good now. Yeah, there's a few down there around. Okay, one right on you. Yeah, 
I see it. Yeah. Yeah. It's too big. I'm already at my leader. Okay. Let's go, baby. That was a loser five. Yeah, it was. From both of us. Okay, it's pretty decent, I think. Let's go, dude. Did I set the hook instantly. I didn't even know if it was a fish for sure. Well, good thing you did. Dude, I seen my graph go nuts, and then you're like, there's one on you. <laughs> Come on, be a big. Guy. It's big. Yeah? Yeah, it's big. If it if it's pulling drag like this and not letting me pull it up. It's a good one. Yeah. Okay, this is a light rod though, so, but it, it's nice. It's a nice bird, head, I know that for sure. I don't want to horse him. Okay, he's coming up. It's a stud. <laughs> it's a tank. <laughs> Let's go. Dude, that's a tank. Let's go. Well, that, that did not take very long. Hold on, let me uh, get him unhooked quick. Right in the bottom of the lip. A little jig head. Let me get the snow off him quick, too. I don't let go. <laughs> How do I give him that tickle? You yeah, yeah, just right, like, right behind their ear. Like, if they had an ear. Or, like, the back of their head, too. Sometimes right in the middle, yeah. Right there? Yep. Dude, that thing is like freaking weird. You got some love spots and whatnot. Freaking leopard of the lake, y'all. Brett literally just took off over here to go look for a spawn ball because we're seeing a bunch of fish here, but they're not biting. Like, there's gotta be a hunter burbot in this little area here. We're marking them consistently and yeah, they're just not doing it. All right. Should we eat this? Can we eat that one? I don't know. Is that one like too big? I don't know what it's like. I don't know what a good size is too. Okay, y'all. It sounds like we are gonna keep this one. Brett says this is a good harvester, so. Sick. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna slit this sucker's throat. Well, we told, I thought they were right there. You drilled a hole. You got down there for 30 seconds. And you, 30 seconds. You Every got... fish that we're seeing, they're going around us and just taking this line here. So, we're like, hey, let's drill a hole right there. Let's catch another one. All right, Joe. We're going to get all baited up once again. And this is what we're using for bait. I'm putting on one big old minnow head. Then I'm going to take the tail. Hook that one by the tail. Then we're gonna look for a pretty good size fat head. These are all fat heads, by the way. In case you're curious. Grab ourselves a good one. Oh! And this one we're gonna keep whole. And just hook this one right in the tail also. So that when you're laying this on bottom, you got that, that big full one kicking and making that bait move. Oh, without further ado! Let's try to catch some more of these big suckers. Dude, that's a toad. Yeah, that's a good one. It's a pretty big one. A lot of meat on that sucker. Should we come over there? Okay, grab the auger. All right, Joe. Brett found a spawn ball. Unfortunately, we couldn't. I was trying to put a chip in that. In that. Uh, I was trying to put a chip in that aqua view, and it kept saying error. So. Unfortunately, we don't have a chip in that thing, so you guys can't see, but Brett just found a, a bird ball, which is pretty much just like a big ball of burbot spawning. And yeah, usually when they're spawning, they're like really active and usually munching. See how crazy my graph's going? Yeah. And I know I'm by the spawn ball. As soon as that stops, I just switch. Oh, see one's got me. Didn't bite though. So should we put one just like right here? I'd put a couple up in here, yeah. Okay. All the way to the one right to where my auger's at. Okay. Nice. Is that the lake trout rod? Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah, I got some all over oh, me this too. This a snag because I never felt it. I just lifted up and he was on. Really? But that happens quite a bit. 
or they or you feel them you going straight braid yeah it was bottom of the lips oh yeah nice, oh. That's a nice one. it's not bad nice dude not bad at all in my eyeball that happened pretty instant yeah <laughs> if you get on the spawn ball it's like that like every time is guaranteed yeah oh sick come on buddy it's all wrapped up there you go sweet gorgeous almost a blondie yeah come on baby get your head in there oh, sick sweet. that didn't take long no what's that Notice how most of them are going this way, though. Uh huh. Follow them. That's what I like to do. Follow them. Yeah, they did from here. Yeah, it doesn't take long. It wasn't a big enough spawn ball for two different ones. Huh? Spawn ball. Look at that it's rock. Do you see them? Oh yeah. On the pan optics. Can you see him on that? I'm guessing there's somewhere right up in here. Oh my lantern. Yeah, yeah, yeah they're yeah, flying kind of right. Yeah. Oh, I wouldn't let the camera hang out for a real long time. I don't know. Might be something I'm thinking, but. Dude, they're just going all around us. They're not in a spawn ball? No. They're just literally consistently swimming everywhere. Oh my god, I just had one. Huh? Double whip right there, huh? Yeah. Right when I went to my thing, I looked and one just munched it up. Nice, Brock. Okay, I'll pull this up. Don't help. There's a shit ton down there, but they're all moving this way. Beauty. Dude, that'd probably be a good eater, eh? Should we keep that just so we have our two? Yeah. Just so we have uh, enough for a little catchy cook? Bang, bang, Rolby. Gorgeous though. Yeah, dark that's a, one. That's a dark one. Love to see it. Yeah, I really wish we had a chip for this underwater camera, but it's not working. Every time I push record, it says no micro SD card. And there is one in there. Okay, well, we got her too. That's cool. Now we're fishing for guys fun. Might as well keep fishing right here while I I'll, keep searching. I'll look again. Just look for another ball. Two. Hold it. No spawn ball. No spawn ball. And like nothing. Oh, there's a couple. There's one right there come in. Oh yeah. I'm gonna move down again to see if they're over where they were this morning. Even though most of them are headed this way. Oh, look at this guy. Go get her. Double oh, no, dipper. Over there. <laughs> hey, two rods. Two rods. You wanna go skiing? <laughs> really? Yeah. No shoot. Out bottom? Yeah. Oh, dang. Quick. <laughs> yeah, it was. Not a bad one either. See how skinny they are now? Yeah. Come on, fella. really good. Heck yeah, dude. Little baby girl. Boy, whatever. You get bored out to me. <laughs> it gotta be somewhere right next to you, Murray. Really? There you go. There you go. A little belly action there. Love it. <laughs> That's hot. I was hoping you didn't see that. Sorry, but we did. Sorry, but we did. There he is. 
just a freaking fatty, dude. Fatty! Look at that thing. <laughs> My hand's so cold. Alright, you crush one. I you deal with that. Down the hole. Yeah. I'm back. Holy shit. Yeah. They're in between me and you. Oh my lantern. Spondo. Him dispersing though? Yeah. A little bit. That's so cool though. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay, now let's catch up. Right. Should be right on you like the lore. They are. Huh? Nice. Nice. Good. It looks pretty good. Are you boat flipping there? What are you doing? What was that? <laughs> I need to get rid of some leader. <laughs> that was intense. I didn't think it was that big and then it all of a sudden came up. Dude, that's a tank. Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> and you tried both living it. Oh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> oh, my lantern. Well, let's let her You want a pick? Yeah, maybe. Get a pick, at least one. Yeah. Nice full release on the guy. Dude, Brock's crushing. The spoon. Something. You don't it's have a spoon. spoon. We're both using jig heads. No. Oh, I'm switching to the spoon. Switch it up? Yeah, I'm about to. You just want to use that rod? No. Psych, because you'd have to retie it. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I said no. Again. Oh, do I have to clean it? I don't care. I can clean it. You know how to clean them? I think so, yeah. No! No way. Ugh. No, bad. no, you're fine. That thing freaking smoked me. Definitely took all my minnows. That was suspended. Really? Yeah. Oh. Damn it. Yeah, I can clean them, dude. I'll pr if I do it, I'll probably do it on my tailgate. Huh? There's a fucking lot of like 80 of them right here. Oh, oh yeah. That is sick. That is insane, dude. Mm -hmm. Which way is that? Probably no idea now that you know. Uh, just to the right of me. See, it comes up shallow right there. Oh, yeah. yeah, it drops off. It okay. might even be just like right here. Right here yeah. somewhere. Yeah. Or we don't have a hole. Yeah, weird. Here. But that's, that's them. That's them. Yeah, there's plenty of them there. <laughs> well, do I drill a hole like right here then? or? Wait for him to move. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I'm seeing anything. I might be off the side. Ha, ah, it's like. I'm off the side a little bit, but I'm still getting hit. But this is a. <laughs> no way, dude. Dude, this is a wad of them, too. Good. Hey, dude. No. This came off. Here. Hey, minnows. God damn it, that sucks. It felt like a big one. Update, y'all. Brock went and grabbed the truck, and I think we're about to set up camp right here just because we are seeing just a ton of burbot just congregating within like this whole 50 yard stretch here. So we're gonna set up portable. I'm sure we will do a little bit hole hopping still and try to find like big burbot balls and stuff too. But yeah, we're gonna set up the shack, get her going. update yo currently 422 it's about to get dark pretty soon here so i'm about to uh 
go outside and clean those burbits before it gets too cold. Stay tuned. Mm -hmm. Look at those big, thick boys. Look at them. That's one of these boys. And I am not a professional burbit cleaner by any means. But I kind of know I kind of know what I'm doing a little bit. I'm just gonna follow this down. And you don't want like the belly part of this fillet. You really only want like the back straps right here. So I'm going to stop right there. Just cut that chunk off right there. Look at that nice fillet. Dude, look at this. Big, <laughs> big female. Oh, oh, gross. Look at that. Let's go ahead, do the same thing to this side. Cut out that back strap. Bam. And then for this chunk here, this little piece of meat, uh, you pretty much just flay it like a walleye. Start in here. And I'm just gonna kind of press down and go down this whole fish's tail. Ooh, that was kind of shitty, but we got her. I move over. I thought they're gonna eventually. How'd I do? I don't Good. know. I really don't know what I'm doing. I've only cleaned like two burbits. Not bad I though. Just, yeah, I usually just clean them all the way through. As soon as you get to like right here and you start seeing the skin, yeah, just follow the bone line. Okay. As soon as you see the skin, just cut it there. That's good. Yeah, it's a lot easier to get that skin off though if it's one full piece. Oh really? Mm-hmm. So start like here. It could here. be cleaner though. Yep. And should I like go to here? Yep. Go to this. Go to the spine. It should be somewhere right in there. And then just yep. Follow down. Oh. Yep. Hmm. Yeah, now you can go all the way through. I can oh, get cut all the way, just like a walleye. Yeah, I always flip them like on their side when I clean them. Nope, no, just follow it like that. Dang, nope. that's way better. Yep. Alright. Look at that. I'm a professional burbiter now. Yeah. Got our burbits cleaned and ready to go. Stay tuned. I'm about to take off my bibs, I think, and get comfy. Brett's still out with the underwater camera looking for him, but it sounds like he hasn't hooked up once the whole time we've been in here. So, yeah, we're steady marking. So, I'm about to just take the clothes off and hang out in here. Oh, frick yeah, dude. Yeah. Damn, it's it. warm in here, dude. <laughs> nice, eh? I told them boys I ain't stepping outside my truck. I'm like, okay. Okay. I ain't putting my boots on. <laughs> it's nice. Ah, my, it's just, Twisted I need to go home. Hand. I need a drink. I need to go home. You need one of these? No. Half and half. No. Lemonade? Yeah. Half and half. <laughs> you butler for your boy? I don't like those. Mm. But those are good. Yeah, well, we can't all bang super hot moms. Yeah, what? Flew right past me. It's going you to guys need an underwater camera? Yeah. I got one in my truck. Well, does it work at night? Dude, fuck yeah, if you have it in that hole and you turn the light on it, you can see your jig. Dude, like I'll a go light. Put it. You can see a, like a light, light bulb. Get it. I'm not kidding. Let me use it for a minute. You can fucking use it. The battery might die, but you might just have to plug I it into it. that. Yeah. Yeah. Is a freaking G. And whoa, what's up with the camera? Hold on. It probably broke when it looked at me. <laughs> okay, we're back. We got the whole gang in here, and Nick is letting us use his Markham underwater camera because Brett's using mine. And we can use this all night. You can have it back to me whenever no, I know, but you can see at night. Oh, yeah, turn the light on. If it's from that hole to that hole, You'll see that jig like a light bulb. And we can there. see we can see both jigs right now. Yeah, it's perfect. Brox is right here. Mine's just right here. Pretty badass. Let me get some underwater. Anyway, stay tuned.
Hopefully we can get some. Dude, we haven't gotten one yet since we've set up this fish house. Because you got to watch the camera. I'm not kidding. I know. I feel... Dude, I know. Dale, come Eyes by good. and nip your minnows right off if you're not watching them on a camera when to set the hook. Yep. It's so dumb. Update, y'all. The rest of the gang took off. Just got myself and B-Rock back out here. And we haven't seen a whole lot of fish in here the past, like, hour. So me and B-Rock are about to gear up and uh, go try to catch some bourbon or at least go like check all the holes out there there's like 50 holes and you think we'd be able to find some somewhere but they're not right here right now so yeah stay tuned hopefully next scene is us catching a bourbon or something on me please eat it he just touched it he touched it Came right up to it. No, yeah, he, he just touched it with like his tail. No, dude. I've missed three. I don't need a camera. Just to see him eat it. That one pounded it. Dude. Really? Yeah. Yes! Yes! Dude, my hands are so cold I can't like keep my wrist straight. Okay. 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 Whoa. Yes. Let's go. Good one, dude. What do you think? <laughs> dude, I'm so cold that like my wrists don't work. This is a nice one. Let's go. Oh. You have two liter yet? I think I'm tangled with you. No. You sure? Oh, yeah, you are, dude, Yeah? No. No? So weeds or what? No. Big bike? No, it's just a big bird. Almost weed you No! No, dude. No, no, dude. It was barely hooked. I was guiding his head right up the hole. I, I, I saw it there and I was to roll my sleeve. No. Damn it. That's a big one, dude. Damn it, where the minnows? Right there. Oh. oh, there's just a bunch down there. God dang it, dude. Dude, my hands don't work. You know, it's about to get even colder. No fucking way. You got one? Damn, I got quick clean too. How's it feel? Hey, dear. Whoa. I thought it was really little, but it's not. <laughs> it's a little crazy got me. Nice. Dude, yeah. Nice yeah. one. Heck yeah. He shoots, he freaking scores. <coughs> Let's go, dude. I, was, I didn't even see it. It just crawled on the bottom and just freaking smoked it. Really? Yeah. Dude, I've missed five. <laughs> What is going on? Tough crowd for yeah, old I mean, as you can tonight. see, he barely just freaking got it though. Yeah, I know. That's a nice one though. Yeah. It real like a tan, tan color. Yeah. That kind of just looks like all the rest of them on the camera. Very sweet though. Yeah, your hands got to be cold. Yeah. Let's get a graceful release on them.
We do indeed. We are back in the shack, y'all. It is 10 o'clock, dude. Holy cow. Yeah. Holy cow. I thought it was like 7.38. We are back in the portable. My my freaking cheeks are probably red still. It is freezing outside right now. I freaking must have missed like six fish out there, y'all. Just freaking brutal. Only had one up to the hole, but B-Rock ended up landing one. That's pretty sweet. Anyways, yeah, we're finally hungry. I think we're going to, uh, I'm going to cook up this burbot for us. I think I'm only going to cook half the burbot, though. There's, there's a lot of burbot. Alright. Don't need that. Need that. Need that. Ah. Damn. I still need to chunk that up a little bit. Definitely need to do that. Just got the bear bots chilling right here. This bag looks more full, so we're gonna use this one. And I need this. And I think I'm going to use this big old pan, don't need this. y'all just have to wait for that water to boil once it starts boiling we're gonna toss in the chunks of eel pot and we only have to let it boil for four minutes after that we're gonna strain all the water out of there melt some butter put it back in the pan and season it up and whatnot and yeah that's pretty much the whole process the reason we're boiling it is because it is not like like northern or walleye or like crappies and stuff like that it's like a totally different kind of meat people actually call it poor man's lobster that's yes. like what the consistency and texture is like it's like more like lobster it literally tastes exactly like lobster we have to water at a nice roaring boil and take our eel pot without dropping them and literally as you can see this is unseasoned too by the way we're boiling this without seasoning it we're just gonna take all these slam them in there Ooh, that water's hot. Just touched it. I'm gonna grab our phone. Already got it set for four minutes. And we're just gonna lightly stir these around the whole time these are boiling for that four minutes. And you really, you, you do not wanna go over five minutes. That's what I've heard is like the number one thing with these burbot, cause they're really easy to mess up. So we're setting the timer for four minutes, but if this don't boil for another like, 30, 40 seconds, then I'll probably let her go for five minutes. Ah, it's already starting on the sides. It, that water's hot. All right, timer's done. That's roaring. I think we should be good. I gotta keep this on a little bit. We're gonna try to do this outside. You wanna see the tongs? Yep. Yeah. We gotta get all this water out here. Oh yeah, those are done. Like money, dude, too. Yeah, they look really good. I don't want to lose any. Okay, put, I'm gonna dump them in there. Okay. Now, we're going to use the same pan, but I gotta turn this down a little bit. And then the main thing for this part, y'all, is you do not want to burn the butter. Which is tricky with this shitty camping pan and this gas stove. There's this one there. Big dog. You're starting to mark them again, hey? Yeah. Alright. I think this butter's pretty much ready. Is this hot? What? You just had it. No way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I should have been sitting down. I would have set this book right in the ceiling. Oh, I gotta do this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wanna watch, though. Now we're gonna take all these burbits. Sorry I'm doing this with my hands, Brock. I don't care. It's gonna get cooked anyway. They're somewhat clean. Kinda. I and I gotta do this fast. Now we gotta take our phone 
Set it for two minutes tops, and we're going to take ourselves some Tony shush 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 shush. Wow, there's a bunch in here. Thank you. And you want a lot, like a lot, like where you think you got too much. Next, we got ourselves some garlic powder, and we want a lot of that. Like honestly, like a amount that you're like, well, that's too much. I'm just gonna go ahead and stir this around. Once again, you do not want to burn that butter. You basically want this fish to absorb all of it, I think. That's what I'm guessing. I feel like I'm at the freaking lobster buffet at the old Grand Casino. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, <laughs> it smells so good. How long we got? 30 seconds. That's it, y'all. I think it's done. Should be the official taste tester. It's probably hotter than shit, but. Unbelievable. I crushed it. It's perfect. Oh my god. Get yourself a piece of this, boy. Oh, you can't even really see. Mm. Scale 1 to 10. It's 100. Gotta give a huge shout to Cousin Brett for this one. This is his recipe. Or not his, but... He taught us how. <laughs> Dude, it reminds me of just like a... Well, lobster, lobster, lobster <laughs> but well, yeah. so these little backstrap pieces, like right here, did you get one of these yet? Yeah, it's more mm -hmm. firmer. It mm -hmm. it reminds me of a crab leg, just a cut in half crab leg. Yeah, like if you just pulled it out and then had Yeah, that. yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, it's bomb. All right, stay tuned, y'all. Me and Brock are going to host this in a minute. <laughs> yeah, we're pretty much just gonna race and go as fast as we can, so we can get as much as we can. <laughs> it's so good. It's really good and it's addicting. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm putting this camera down. Update, y'all. Got everything cleaned up, and we got the underwater camera down there. We've actually had it down there for a solid half an hour now, and we haven't seen a single fish on there, and just a few swimming around us on the panoptic so we're gearing back up once again i'm already ready we're gonna go back out hole hopping with the underwater camera and see if we can't find some spurbit some spawning burbits a bird ball or just look for any cruisers or something like that you might have to take that flash off on me you think i know Yeah, dude. Did you think I meant this? What was that? That's a weed. Okay. That one dipped instantly. Really? We saw it. But we're getting closer. I mean, look at this. Yeah. What, we checked like 20 holes. Are you recording? Yeah. Yeah, dude. This is nuts. Crazy. We've seen one burbot. I don't think we got it on camera either. We're too slow. Yeah, we were. You picked it the heck went to get the camera. Oh, shoot! Oh, yeah, no, we've been doing that. <laughs> oh, we're back in the fish house, y'all. Brock's filling up his water. And that was a struggle bus, but we gave her our all. We checked 40 freaking holes, and we only seen one burbot, which is crazy because we were out there an hour and a half ago and literally stumbled upon a bird ball with just our graphs. And it was just bare down there. Didn't see nothing. Anyway, stay tuned. I believe it is like almost midnight now. It is midnight. It's 12.07. Not sure how much longer I'm going to last. Might get horizontal soon here. We know you like that. Give the skull back or we're going to run this thing until it's burnt. <laughs> we're going to run this thing. Dude, he says the same thing in every freaking one. Hey, this is the all down of Fluffy Pouch. <laughs> this is a game strip clip. Uh, you forgot your credit card down here last night. Looks like you maxed it out. I don't know if you want it back. Um, call me back. We got it. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Yeah, this is Terry from Down the Road. 
<laughs> Nick's been doing this for fucking three years. Yeah, this is Glenn down at the the, the, the puppy palace. The gay strip club. <laughs> I'm guessing you left your credit card here behind the counter. Looks like you maxed her out. I don't know if you left it on purpose. Well, she did a lot of lap dances. Okay, we got it. Call me back. Is it on you? Oh my god. I can see it. He went past me. Look at this. Why is it so cold, dude? Isn't this thing banked in good? Look at how wet the sides are. Constipation. Back at her. Dude, why is it so cold in here, though? It is like 2 in the morning, y'all. I am officially horizontal. Haven't marked a burbot in like the past hour. And it's freezing out. So. Yeah. I'm about to try to go to bed. If one of us catches one or something. Uh, guys will see it. If not, we'll probably just see you in the morning. Night night. Good morning, y'all. It is currently... <laughs> Like, and it is snowing slash raining. It's nasty out. Brack's freaking cashed out still. I'm in my underwear because my sweatpants are like damp. Damn, my whole. Drip, really? Oh man, look at the wall. Yeah, dude, I kind of woke up soaked. Like, just really damp. What the hell happened? I don't know. Ugh. Anyways, we got the heat cranked. It is... I think it's like 8 o'clock. Could even be earlier, honestly. Let me check. 8, 9, 10, 7, 30. All the same. Oh, let me get back in here. Yup, yup, yup. Feels better in here with my pants off. Oh, what else we got in here? Oh. My jacket. This thing's all damp, too. Anyways, y'all, I think we're going to end this video here. Really hope y'all enjoyed it. Myself and B-Rock had a kick-ass time. If you guys could, like this video. Share this video on your Facebook. Subscribe. I think that's it. Love you. Peace out.